So have you guys seen these yet? I got these sent to me by the Gold Cross LLC. You can get them on eBay, Amazon, they have a store site. I'll put the link in the description. So what these are is a different approach to pellets, never like we've seen before. These are actually 3D printed. Not just regular pellets, these are called their Waymakers. I got two different kinds here I'm going to show you today. Cool thing is, is even the case is 3D printed. So the pellets are 3D printed, the case is 3D printed. And that's pretty neat. Let's take a look, open them up and see what they look like. These are steel core ammo. If you're familiar with uh, Gamma Lethals, uh, H&N Hornets, they have steel or brass center in the pellet for penetration. Let's take a closer look at these. So there they are. You get 48 in the box. Nice little case there. Uh, let's pull one out and get a closer look. So there they are. The whole skirt and everything of the pellet is 3D printed. Uh, some sort of plastic composite. And then you can see it's got a steel core in the center. And then we got these ones made by the Gold Cross. These are called the MSS Morningstar. They're a 22 caliber sparking ammo. This company makes these and the other ones I showed you in a 177 and 22 caliber. Uh, they are going to be coming out with a bigger bore here in the future, I'm told. But let's open these up to have a look at them. There they are. And the center of these pellets, as you can see, that center is actually filled with a, like a ferro rod. So it's going to emit sparks when you hit. You got to hit something hard and should be towards dusk or a not so lit area for most visual effects on these. We'll, see, we'll test them for accuracy. We'll test them for penetration. Uh, I'll get you an FPS on them as well, and we'll see what you guys think. We'll be using the Hot Sun Flash 22 caliper PCP to do these videos today. Okay, for our very first test, we're going to shoot it on a piece of wood, but we're going to compare it to a regular pointed Crossman Premier Hollow Point, and I have H&N Hornets. We will do a comparison between the three pellets to see what does what, who's better. Um, you know, what you're actually getting here. Okay, so we got the pointed, we got the gold cross, and we got the H&N Hornets. I just got a piece of half inch pine set up. We're going to take three shots, one with each pallet, and see what it looks like on the back side of that board, compare it for damage. First shot, crossman pointed. I do have you on scope cam. We're just going to go right to the top of the board. Work our way down with the pellets. There's the pointed. Next up is the H&N Hornets. Finally, we've got the brand new Waymakers. I imagine these are going to be loud because they feel extremely light. Let's see what they do. Very, very loud indeed. Let's go have a look. Okay, there was our pointed, there was our H&N Hornet, and that little tiny hole right there is our Waymakers. Uh, it shedded the case, the core kept going as intended. Let's look at the back side. Okay, as far as damage goes, the regular pointed definitely did the most damage, followed by the H&N Hornet, and then we got a small exit there from the center core of those wave makers. So, seemed like they're accurate so far. Um, let's continue testing. Alright, so now we got a piece of regular 2x4. I don't know if any of my rounds will go the whole way through this, but maybe we can get a comparison on how deep they do go. Okay, two by four. First shot, pointed. We're gonna work our way from the bottom to the top this time. There's our pointed. This 
there's our H&N Hornet. We hit a little high. And now for the Waymaker. Let's go for that red circle. Let's go have a look. Okay. Pointed, H&N Hornet, Waymaker. Let's look at the back. Okay, that dent was there before. That is not from a pellet. Um, but, as far as penetration goes, check that out. The uh, Waymaker went clear through that 2x4. The H&N Hornet did not. Uh, that is highly shocking. I've never had anything have better penetration than an H&N Hornet. Accuracy? It was right on. Um, I can't argue with that. Them things are pretty darn amazing. Last thing we're going to do on those for today's video is I'm going to get you an FPS on them. It sounds like them things are freaking honing out of that. I mean, it's louder than a 22 long rifle coming out of my gun. Neighbors probably aren't going to be too happy. Okay, let's do an FPS on this and see if we can get a reading. One thousand one hundred ninety six feet per second. Them things are cooking. Wavemakers. So I'm very pleased with these things. The accuracy is there. The penetration is definitely there. Um, really cool to 3D printed. I haven't seen anybody do that yet. They're cheap. That's what I like. Uh, compared to a pack of H&N Hornets, I mean, you can get Two 48 packs of these for about the same price as one pack of H&N Hornets. That's the price difference. Super fast, they are loud, uh, they're definitely supersonic, but it doesn't seem to be hurting the accuracy any. Them things seem to be dead on. Uh, we'll come back on the next video and we will do the Morning Stars and check out the sparkage on that and see how cool they look. Uh, more of a novelty, but we'll check them out. So thank you Gold Cross LLC for sending me these check out today. Very awesome. You guys need to check them out. Thanks for following me today. See you guys next time.